Hello. <laughs> I love that. Very catchy. Well, man of mystery, I am the lady of mystique. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> how do you, um, how do you fit in here? Mm-hmm. Oh, no, actually, I don't know them. No. I'm kind of, um, friend of a friend, shall we say? Mm. It is a great party, though, I, I have to admit this is Incredible. Some of the outfits here are just mind-blowing. People must have spent so much time on them. Feels like something right out of Hollywood. Like old Hollywood. <laughs> Phantom of the Opera. <laughs> something like that. Mm. Well, I mean... <laughs> red, black, and white are my favorite colors, so when I found out that was the uh, color scheme, that kind of tipped me into the, I'm definitely coming. <laughs> it's a great thing to do on a Friday night, don't you think? Mm -hmm. And this, this house is incredible, if you can even call it a house. Yeah, it just keeps going and going, and have you been into the garden? Oh my gosh, the garden is just incredible. All the lights. You should definitely check it out. It is amazing. Mm -hmm. It really is. Yeah. I'm a sucker for twinkle lights though. It's just something so warm and friendly and magical about them. Don't you think? So tell me about yourself. The mystery man. <laughs> yeah. Mm. That's exciting. actually surprisingly comfortable. <laughs> Who knows, I might have to incorporate this into my daily wear. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> mm. It is metal, yep. That's right. Which you think would be very uncomfortable, but I'm, I'm surprised to say it's wonderful. And normally masks cut into your eyes a little bit and my eyelashes have a hard time but this is such a perfect fit who knew mm. well they're lovely they just look so happy don't they mm. You'd be nice. Mm -hmm. No, I, just, I especially love the lady right over there. That hair is incredible. I think she probably went through 10 hairspray cans, but it looks amazing. <laughs> That's your mom. Oh, oh. oh you were impressed. <laughs> Not your mom. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> I was gonna say, she 
she looked a little bit, um, you know, never mind. <laughs> I do love the people watch. It's my favorite thing, probably. Mm -hmm. One of my favorite thing, but it's up there. Yeah. I don't know. There's just something beautiful about it. It takes you, when you're actually sitting or standing, and observing people. I don't know, it takes you out of yourself a little bit. You're watching other people. And of course, some people watch and judge and are rude about it. But to me, it's the opposite. It's like, look at those people having fun. And this couple right here, this couple right here. They are having so much fun, and I love how happy they look and the way that they're looking at each other, and the dancing. I mean, who doesn't love to watch people dance? You don't dance? Come on, everybody dances. <laughs> I didn't say that everybody dances well, I just said everybody dances. And I do think that's a very, um, important distinction, so there's that. Um, yeah, because truly, you hear some music and you just move your body and it doesn't have to be, you can just bounce. If that's all you wanted to do, you can just bounce or nod your head or, you know. <laughs> you make you put them like, <laughs> you know, uh, I thought my head circle was fantastic. Thank you very much. Um, <clears throat> like I said, you don't have to dance well. You just have to get out there. And it's a release. It should be, you know, therapeutic in a way. You're, you're just feeling the music. <laughs> okay, maybe it's a bit much for our first conversation. <laughs> You think you're funny? Well, I think it looks amazing and wonderful and beautiful what they're doing and who cares? Who cares? They're having the time of their life. And that's what matters. You know, life's about moments and memories and the rest... Meh. Can you hold this for just a second? Thank you. My gloves are falling down. Can't have that. Mm, you like them? You wanna feel? They're smooth, right? <laughs> well, I'm actually incorporating gloves more and more into my day-to-day -day life. Oh, I can't tell you what I do. Then you could find out who I am. Remember? We're mysterious. I know, masks don't really hide that much, but... You know, you'd be surprised. It does feel good to get back out again, doesn't it? And I love the, the spin on it, you know, getting rid of the masks, but having a masked party, a masquerade, ah, I love it. It does, it gives people a chance to get back out into the world and, you know, be social because, oh my gosh, it's so, there's a lot of people with social anxiety, of course, but, um, we need other humans. Mm -hmm. Tell me about it. What podcast was that? Okay. I might have to look that up. It's fascinating. Actually, you know, I did hear something um, about just like the little interactions you have, uh, day to day, like, 
you go to the store, you're checking out the grocery store, and you talk to somebody in line, and just that little bit of acknowledgement is actually really important, which is so funny because I kind of just put my head down and just kind of drop through it, but I guess it is important just to have people around you. I don't know. Well, there's plenty of people tonight. Thank you. Sorry. I forgot you're holding it. What are you drinking? Mm, looks good. Well, cheers. Mm. Yeah. Oh, you have no idea. Nah, I mean, she's killing it right now, but later she's gonna have to take five ibuprofen just to walk in those things. <laughs> well, you know, we'll strap some heels onto your feet and see what you think. See how comfortable they are. <laughs> you have. No, you haven't. No, you haven't. I don't believe you. You fooled me once. You have not done drag. No, you haven't. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. I don't know if I should believe you or not, though, because that was not your mom. So, see, we're starting this, um, you know, friendship uh, with some trust issues. <laughs> mm-hmm. Well, Mr. Mystery Man, um, they do hurt. Heels do hurt, yes. Most of them. Mm hmm That's why I was saying those are, those are stilts. And her feet are going to be feeling it later. Mm-hmm. But she looks amazing. So, probably worth it. Yeah, I mean, we can definitely go out to the garden if you want. Check it out. See the little twinkle lights? Okay. See what I mean? It just looks beautiful. Yeah. The little twinkle lights. And it feels good out here, don't you think? Yeah. Mmm. What a beautiful garden. Oh, yeah? No, I, uh, I wish I could, but, um, sadly, I kill things. Plants. Plants. I kill, I kill plants, not, oh my gosh. <laughs> I kill plants. I have black, brown. I think that's the term. But um, anyways, yeah, I, uh, I've tried several times and uh, so far it's just not something that I do well and so I have finally decided know your strengths, know your limits. Plants are just not going to be something that I excel at and um, that's okay. You do? Hmm. Well, honestly, I'm not quite sure what to think yet. I mean, you lied to me about your mom, but you're definitely very handsome. Uh, you may or may not have done drag, and you have a beautiful garden. You're very interesting. Hmm. Mm-hmm. And you're friends with the host, so... Oh, you helped them plant that? <laughs> no, you did not. <laughs> okay. See, I'm on to you. I knew you were lying that time. 
No, but yeah, it's a beautiful night and um, I couldn't ask for, you know, a more entertaining evening. Now she's inside. At least I think she is. I saw her right before we walked out here, so. No, she's fine. She's making her rounds. She's a little bit more outgoing than I am. So she has to uh, kind of bounce around. Me, I, I tend to um, just kind of hug the wall and observe for a while. People watch, which you already know is one of my favorite things. So that's what I was doing when you pointed at me. Mm. No, I still got a little bit more. Thank you for asking, though. Mm. You're sucking yours down pretty quickly, though. You're not driving, right? Fantastic. You have a driver. Okay. I have a driver, too, but she's flirting. <laughs> it's a little bit different. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You won't fit in these. You want to try it on? You're going to stretch it out. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> You're going to ruin them. You know what? Never mind. I don't want you to try it. These are already slightly large for me, just right here. So if you put them on, I already know they'd be way too stressed out and um, I don't really want that. So. Mm. <laughs> it's actually getting a little bit chilly in here. Do you mind if we... um? Go back inside for a minute. Thank you. Thank you. Dance? No. Um, no, not yet. I need a, one more of these before. Oh, okay, thank you. Thank you. That was fast. Mm. Mm. Okay. I appreciate it. Yeah. Maybe after one of these I'll be ready to get out there. Maybe. Mm. No, yeah, she's right over there. I saw her. Spotted her out. Did you come with somebody or? No, just a brave soul. I don't know, I feel like coming to a party by yourself. And there's a lot of weird people out there. A lot of weird women. <laughs> mm, yep. Mm -hmm. Plus everybody's masked, you know, safety first. You wouldn't even be able to describe me if I, uh, did rob you, huh? <laughs> Just a woman in a mask. Oh my gosh. You flatter me, sir. Mm. I do like this song, though. Mmm. Yeah, maybe. I don't know if I put this down. I may not ever find it again. Mm. 
So anything else you want to tell me? You got two left feet or... Oh, you can. Okay. Well, finish this, then you can show me your moves. Show me what you got. Hmm. You've already seen mine. Yes, the face is very important. You gotta have the right, like, jaw thrust when you dance, or it's just the whole thing's off. like a lady. I, I only look classy. Really, I'm, um, <clears throat> I'm a work of art, actually. <laughs> Picasso. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, it can't all be, um, Monet's. All right. One more step and we can go tear it up. Mm. I lied too. Two more steps. Okay, mystery man. You ready to go dance? Okay, I'll follow you. <laughs> 